Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you the throttle linkage configuration on your lawnmower with a Briggs Quantum engine. And here's the lawnmower I'm going to show you this configuration on today. I've removed the recoil assembly as you can see and the top cover. I've got them sitting over here and the gas tank is also off. I had to remove them all to show you exactly where they connect. Now I'm going to start right at the carburetor. Here's the carburetor here for those of you who are new to small engine repair. And you can see the metal linkage is hooked in to the carburetor lever right here, which is made of plastic. As you can see, there's really only one hole where the linkage will fit in. And as you can see, the linkage has a Z-band at the end, so you can't just pull it off. And I'm going to follow this linkage all the way down to where it's connected. It goes underneath the flywheel, as you can see. And then it connects into the governor arm over here. And then the governor arm is screwed on to this little shaft over here which actually goes to the governor mechanism inside the engine. Now if we come back to the carburetor, you can see that a spring is hooked into the loop here on the linkage, and that spring is connected over here on this metal part. Sometimes when your engine's not revving high enough anymore, just replacing the spring will make it rev higher, or if you tighten up the spring, it will also make it rev higher. Now be careful if you're going to play with the engine speed, because you can blow the engine if you over rev it. Now this engine here I believe was made in 02, 2002. Now in some different years the configuration may vary slightly but just so you know this is going to be your typical setup on these engines. And this throttle linkage configuration today is on a lawnmower that does not have a throttle control on the handlebars. What you see up there is for the front wheel drive of the lawnmower. If you do have a lawnmower with the throttle control on the handlebars which will be an older lawnmower the configuration may vary as well. So I'll just do a quick recap here. The linkage is connected on the top part of the carb. It goes all the way underneath the flywheel, connects to the governor arm. And as you can see, the governor arm is connected to the shaft which goes inside the engine. And when you get back to the carburetor, you can see that a small spring is connected on the loop of the linkage. And then that spring is connected over here in the bigger hole. So bookmark the video for future reference and may come in handy in your repairs in the future. So thanks for watching guys, make sure to subscribe and you can see me in my next video. Have a nice day.